action. Yes. Hello, everyone. I'm here with Mr. E. How you doing? And my new friend, Blue Dragon 5. Greetings. And we're here... So I'm not a new friend? (laughs) Yes, you are, Mr. E. (laughs) Uh, We're going to be doing Teen Titans today, guys. Uh, This one will probably have a longer introduction than the rest. I just wanted to let everyone know that that this is what we're doing today. So... uh, (sighs) Yes, and we're going to, and we're doing th- three re- completely random episodes. Uh, they're not not in any particular order. It's just uh, the three episodes each of us chose a few days back. Uh, and we're going to start off with Mister E's choice, which is episode two five seven four nine four, and that's yeah. just the name of it. <laughs> that's the name of the episode. It's also the actual episode like serial number. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yes. Hence why they didn't give it a title. Okay. Uh, so, uh, everyone with your DVDs, get them to time stand zero on this particular episode. All right. And I hope everyone's got their headphones in or whatever, and so we don't have any overlap with the, the sound. Got <laughs> my headphones Same here. All right. And everyone, you can press play. Right about now. All right. Ah, uh, the static opening. Yep. My favorite part of the entire episode just just him just talking to the people. <laughs> yeah, and when my first watched this episode, I was like, "Oh my goodness, he's talking to me." <laughs> Why are you talking to me? Shut up! Ah! Control Freak is just a very funny villain. Mm. Because he's a lot like the people watching the Teen yeah. Titans and just fans yeah. in general. Control Freak was based off of me. <laughs> Control Freak's based off every fan. He's just fa- fanaticism at its finest, just condensed into this one chubby red haired guy. Uh, Control Freak's based off me because I'm fat. Oh, let's not be let's not be harsh. In that high pitched voice, that's my high pitched voice. Well, that one. <laughs> there it is. Well, I'm not a ranger, so he can't be based off of me. <laughs> <laughs> so that just leaves me and you, Blue Dragon Five. Is he based off of you or me? Well, it's not based off me. Oh, okay then. So here's my question: How do you like the roster of the team? I like I, I love it. Yeah, uh, when we get to my episode, I'll t- tell you how much I love it. Alright. It's just that I was really like first... Nevermore. Yes. I really love Nevermore. It's just that uh, I watched this for the first time, and I was like, okay, there's one character I know. Everyone else, I have no idea. Same for me. It wasn't until, like, I started watching the series and discovered they were actual comic book characters. I was like, okay, now I know who they are. I kind of knew who Cyborg was from Smallville. Yeah, that was uh, the only silky. other thing for me. Oh, and the Sorry. writer. The writer of the episode is the writer of the actual series. Yeah. Well, of course I knew who Robin was, so that was my that was what got me into the series, and I watched it, and I really liked it. Mm. Yeah. I, once I watched the show, I was like, ah, oh, my favorite character is going to be Robin, just because I know him more. I kept on watching the series, I was like, my favorite episode, my favorite character is Beast Boy. Because he's funny. I'm still probably Robin, but <laughs> you're pro Robin. Oh, yeah, they're all good though. I, I really want Beast Boy to be the leader of a team, even though he was, <laughs> but it just was short lived. <laughs> yeah. Well, he got a season, so as did Beast they all. So me. Beast yeah. Boy's you. Beast Boy's me. No, Watching I'm TV Beast Boy. For... <laughs> I-, I watch TV for a living. Dibs on Robin. <laughs> Dibs on Robin. Hey, 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 Magpie, you can have Raven. Sweet. <laughs> no, not the, no, you can male. be Raven. <laughs> you can't have Raven. <laughs> You're the male version of Raven. Hey, he's a, hey, he's another bird. Get it? Magpie. Raven. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> there's, the, there's the T car, Magpie. What do you think of that? 
T car. Yeah, a cyborg yeah, car. That's all right. Cyborg car. It's no Batmobile. What about the R cycle? The R cycle is no uh, Bat cycle. It's no Bat pod. How about Beast Boy, the interchangeable animal? Oh, he's pretty cool. I like that. I like that power. It's usually oh. reserved for a villain, but uh, I like that. It's... I just thought you were about to say he's now Ace the Bat Hound. <laughs> no Batman. Actually, if I'm correct, couldn't Beast Boy talk when the animal form in the comics? Yeah, he could talk in the comics, then they took that away in the show. And I believe that made it better. Yeah. Now we have set up for all our parodies in here. Like Star yeah. Wars. Star Wars. Star Wars. Yeah, Star Wars. There's a Highlander quote oh, yeah. later on. There can be only one! Don't you think it's interesting that they rip off Star Wars but not Star Trek? Yeah. I think this like this Star Wars rip off is also supposed to be like a Star Trek rip off because well, it's a it, TV show. Yeah, it's kind of a blend of like every kind of parodies every TV show in existence or reality show in uh, this movie. How, how do you how do you not like? Because like when I first watched this, I was like, oh, I know that one, I know that one, I know that one, I know that one. I know that one. Yeah. And then when that, it came to like the French soap opera, I was like, "Oh, that's just any soap opera on earth." Yeah, yeah. soap uh. operas. It's like, "Oh, my evil, your evil half twin sister, who's dead, who's dressed uh-huh. up." <laughs> it's oh, like, I yep, love, that. I love the design of this remote. Based off the design, of his actual remote. Yeah. Just always looks yeah. kind of cool. I love how he's the ultimate nerd. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. No, no, no. He's a geek, not a nerd. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just Don't saying, get a just suit, Magpie. Oh, I'm sorry, but I thought he was a, a nerd because, well, he had to know maths really well. Yeah. It's more science. Well, you can just call him... Of course you can call him a dork. No, he's not a dork. Okay, okay. He's way too awesome to be a dork. <laughs> no, dork would, uh, no dork would do the invasion of Earth. TV show. Hmm. Like Dee Dee from Dex's lab, Beast Boy has to push the buttons. Uh, no, do not push the button. Okay, Dee Dee, don't touch that button. Look at this right here. This guy, this talk show is knocks Robin out of the way. <laughs> See, uh, when he, it's kind of based off how like? TV hosts always hit on the ladies and he kind of shoves Robin out of the way hit on Starfire. Yeah. yeah. I have a Wouldn't question. You? What does that TV host look like? It's the one from Family Feuds that's not Richard Karn. Because um, uh, when I first oh, I him, I, he looks like someone. Yeah. I do love Starfire, though. She's my favorite female from the show. Really on, Raven's great, but I do love Starfire. She's adorable. Oh, uh, you've just made Magpie mad. No, it's all right. He can have stuff off. Yeah. <laughs> that means okay. we don't have to fight over one. <laughs> hey, that means I get Terra. Yeah, you get Terra. You're Beast Boy, so you get Terra. Booyah! Energy drink. Booyah! Of course. Be yeah. sponsored by... Hey, you're scaring away the fish! <laughs> Cyborg should definitely get some, uh, some... Ca- should get some royalties to that drink. Yeah. yeah. Booyah! It's almost here. The Dukes of Hazard reference. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah that, that's a cool like, move. Uh... Booyah! Oh, she... <laughs> oh, God. It's Barney! Uh, uh, it's a very cheap Barney. <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh. I'm moving. Man. <laughs> I, like, I like his jacket. I gotta yeah. say that. I, I love like the jacket. jacket. I love the shoulder pads of the jacket, too. It looks Japanese. Oh, God. Uh, Why what? oatmeal? <laughs> oh, yeah. Because, because like, oatmeal is all around awesome. Oh, Warner Brothers. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They gotta, they're allowed they to do pull, that. Yeah, they're allowed to rip off their own stuff. And I'm a list Yep. Oh, no. What's about to happen? I wouldn't stand there if I were you. <laughs> Boom. How 
does that work? How does what work? The sign? Uh, how does the sign uh, work? Uh, no, how does gravity not take effect? Uh, James Bond. A, yeah, and it's a view to a kill. Yep. A why, do you, kill. why is it a view to a kill? This is the only one I can I know of which has the Eiffel Tower in it. Ah. We should rename that to a view to kill for. <laughs> I love this little I love the little animation where you see it looks like he's gonna help the guy up by just taking the watch. Take him down. Here's well, the funniest visual of the episode. <laughs> little James. Oh Bond. yeah, you're little, <laughs> but it won't fit. That suit won't fit. Oh uh, yeah. Uh-huh. And yet the glider still works. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here's the creature of the Black Lagoon reference. Mm-hmm. Yeah. God. Mm. That was Godzilla. So no, it's not. It can't be God- Godzilla because, well, otherwise, why no. Zazubar would have a fit. <laughs> well, well, I mean, there's Godzilla a thing in it. Yeah, he does. Like he shoots like atomic blast, and his like his spine lights up for a minute. I mean, not a spine. Uh, of course, Starfire being the girl in distress from the movie. <laughs> it's just a guy in a costume. Oh, that doesn't feel like costume. <laughs> We're sorry. Wait, here it comes, here it comes. Here comes Godzilla. There's the Godzilla oh, yeah. moment. There's Godzilla. Godzilla! Rhino Buster. <laughs> oh, Rhino Bust. Dude, it's like so real in TV world. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, split up, all right. Go to separate television. Godfather. Oh. oh. Yeah. Also, oh, uh, a little bit doc- Doctor. I think it's Doctor. Were no you about more. to say Doctor Evil? I was gonna say Doctor No. Yeah, uh, no, it's more. God, uh, yeah, I think you're right. It's more Godfather because it's. But it's also a James Bond villain reference because he's patting the white cat. Oh, Bl- Blofeld, not Doctor No, not it's Blofeld, isn't it? Yes, yeah. it's Blofeld. Ernst Stavro Blofeld, who I really want to play in the future. It's not happening, mystery. Hey, I'm gonna become an actor someday. Okay, okay, I retract the comment. Uh, Matrix have, reference. I don't have a clue what. Wait, that was the Matrix reference. Yes. This this is like this is the combination of the crocodile hunter and I don't know what. Also, a uh, magpie. That guy uh, is Ron Paulson. He voiced the game show host earlier. Oh, okay. Ron Paulson. He does a real. He should do an Australian accent. Hey, we should do Australian accents right now. Uh, Americans just can't really do an Australian accent. No, it, it, like it's not terrible. It's just they shouldn't do it. I would just say a thing like that, mate. Oh, you should do it. That's a bit better. It's a bit oh, better. So we shouldn't do an Australian accent, mate. Could I, mate? Oh God, that that sounds British. It's just, <laughs> it's just oh, bonkers, football mate. to you, mate. Oh God, no. <laughs> football. Oh. No, 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 no. That's not. Oh uh, no. That's rugby. No, that's gridiron. You envy those. You envy those players, don't you, Magpie? <laughs> Especially the one at the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I, love, I love this little bit where they're fighting each other with the uh, with the bars. Uh, <laughs> leave it a beaver. Yeah, yeah. It's a little, little tea on the cardigan. Uh, yeah. Gee, mom, uh, mom, that'll be keen. Cheapers. Oh no! <laughs> it's not the milkman. Don't answer it. Don't open that door. What is it? It's the Terminator. It'd be hilarious yeah, if the Terminator too, was in the fifties. Look, it's Doctor Seuss's Pelican. Oh, Starfire yeah. Silver. So for... yeah. No, it's Doctor Seuss's Where's My Rhino. <laughs> no, Doctor Seuss's Where's My Hippo. I don't have a clue mm. what this is based off of. That's Crocodile Hunter, but yeah, it's not its not a very good Aussie accent. It's not terrible. It's not sounding British, but it's still pretty good. It's an alien version of the good, the bad, and the ugly. Yeah. That was an alien version of Clint Eastwood. 
more coins. But isn't there a isn't there a DC uh, character that 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 is or or is it Marvel that's based off of? Clint Eastwood. I don't. No, know. Uh, Jonah Hex. Isn't it supposed to be Jonah Hex? Yeah, that's DC. Hmm? Yeah, DC. Someone that. Jonah. Back in the day, if they would have made Jonah Hex back in the day, Clint Eastwood could have played him. Hmm. Uh, here's here's uh, Ravens. I don't know if you've seen or used this yet, but they're uh, the Az- Azrath Metron Zinthos. It's just one of those. <laughs> It's just one of those things where it's like you don't pay attention to this medical ad. <laughs> like, okay, oh, yeah, why okay. is that even here? I know kung fu. Whoa. Oh, up, oh, David Carradine. <laughs> yeah, I love uh, when he says good. that. I know kung fu. Whoa, uh, dude, we just so tripped up and high. I love this yeah, that Billy turns Raven's, Raven's cloak around. He's beating up on your girl, Magpie. Uh, I know, he's eh, he's going to pay for that. <laughs> I, I was just waiting through this entire episode. I was like, where's the Power Ranger reference? Because <laughs> Power Rangers is very popular in TV. Oh, there's God, the Terminator. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, okay, uh, have saw, we had enough? When I first uh, saw that building, I thought it was going to parody Batman the Animated Series from the opening credits. Hmm. He's on the building. They would never see, do that. They did it with Brave and the Bold. Good point. They did? Okay, what yeah. is this? Uh, it's a Jeff Gordon t- Ramsey. No, you're a typical... Frenchman. Uh, 90s cooking show that's a rip off of. They found a hippo, hippo. My hippo. A hippo that's Beast Boy. Don't fall in the water. Just when you thought it was safe to go back in the water, control freaks there. Just when you thought it was safe to go back in the water. <laughs> Coming to theaters near you, the creature from Jones Lake 2. Control. Uh. <laughs> oh, this is New funny, right? alert. Look at Raven here, Magpie. This just cracks me up. Hey, look, but, that's me. No, it's not. <laughs> that might be that might be Dwayne McDuffie on the couch with his kids. I'm not sure. Zombies. Uh... See, look at Raven here, Magpie. <laughs> <laughs> Inside the actor's studio. Yep, James Lipton. This cracks me up with Robin here saying, um, don't watch this, it's about world peace. <laughs> <laughs> don't watch this, world uh, peace. But the person, like the Dr. Payton and all that, the guy's name is that, that's like the person who does the voice of Cyborg's dad's name. Yeah, it's Carr Payton. He has a hard to pronounce name. It's like K K H A R Y or something. <laughs> Handsome green heartthrob. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at James Liston behind Robin. <laughs> Whatever that is. Yeah. Hello. Oh uh, yeah, it's like God. I would have come to this conclusion a lot quicker than them. <laughs> now hey, hey, you get a little bit of leader beast boy in this one, don't there you? There it is. There's Batman. There's the Batman yeah. reference. Uh, Adam West. <laughs> nothing continue. Ah, nothing. Oh, no, uh, <laughs> nothing. I <laughs> uh, just read all this. Hey, did you see the um um the Clash of the Planets year? It said 1977. Yeah. <laughs> That's when Star Wars came on. <laughs> yeah, it was uh like if you haven't picked it up already, we're trying to reference Star Wars. It's like. Have you gotten it? Also, here, here it is. Here's the big one. Empire, yeah. I was like, okay, come on, just get to the thing where you, I am your father. Also, on, notice when, off, when Cyborg's walking, he walks like C-3PO. <laughs> There's the epic note. Uh, no! Here it comes. I was expecting a Darth Vader head for control freak here. 
Yeah. Now that would get him sued. That's kind of kind of the helmet. Yeah, the back of it. Oh. <laughs> oh, here, look at Cyborg. He's walking like C three PO coming up. Watch, watch. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and he's complaining like see through you. Hey, but look, if it came to all three of us and we were like deep into the show, we would be that way too. Yeah. Huh? yeah. And there's a. Oh, I love it. Just casually grabs Raven's cloak. You do not need to see over there. Look at that! The Jedi mind trick doesn't work on Phantom Menace robots. Huh. Yeah. No, Phantom they do robots. not. Yes. Yeah, that is yeah. Highlander. Yeah. There can be only one! But Jedi oh, have two blades. <laughs> you know what they should have done? They should have got Clancy Brown, like, change um, Controlled Speak's voice and then turn it into Clancy Brown's. <laughs> like, there can be only one! Just to make the reference fully. Just eat him. Ah. What? Da, da, da. That's you. <laughs> God. Yeah. I feel like B- Robin might have been the only one who could have actually fought him if he wouldn't have just been standing there and actually yeah. tried to yep. fight him even more. <laughs> yeah. Uh. But I like the well, he's Robin. No, this is the Matrix. It's about to get Matrix here. This is Matrix. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. You, you know what I just realized? What? what? We should have invited Rob's rogues to join us. <laughs> Dragon Ball. Oh yeah. Kali, no way. That's that's Indiana Jones. What I was about to do. Kali Ma. Uh. No. Ah! <laughs> How dare you call me snot colored? That is our word. And that is our word. You cannot use that word. Uh. Oh, this is funny. Here it he turns comes. into Urkel. No, Urkel didn't have braces. Well, I mean, it's, he starts out like Urkel, then he just turns into something. He turned, let's just say this. He turns nerdy. Yeah. And, and say it with me now. Man. Phantom Zone! Phantom yeah, Zone! Phantom Zone, yeah, Phantom Zone. Just, just as a square, not a diamond. Oh, that... Fat butt. Always win. Ah, <laughs> <you're good>. <laughs> <laughs> Plus R two D two. Plus C three PO. Raven just went out of there. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> and now look, they're oh, all just bringing silky. Stuff. No, but here's the thing: this ending is like a TV show ending. The yeah. sitcom ending. A nineties ending. Coffee for some reason. <laughs> Wait, just say this. A nineties ending. Yep. It's full house. And he is the girl. <laughs> uh, no, a Power Rangers ending. Oh. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Ending. Thanks for listening, everyone. Bye bye. Stay tuned. <laughs>